A personality as magnetic as her smile. It looks like you got hit with the puck. Actually, yeah. Jessica Gowie lit up not only the rooms she entered, but the lives of those who loved her. It was this effervescence about her, this, this bigger than life personality, this go for gusto. She had reached for that gold ring and in one horrible evening, her dreams, our dreams, and so many other people's dreams were taken. Taken at just 24 by a gunman in one of several horrific mass shootings over the past year. She was shot six times. Jessie was my world. Jessica Gowie was Sandy's daughter. This was her favorite picture with her stepfather Lonnie. Her love of sports came from her dear friend John Patrick, who says Jesse reminded him to live every day. Jesse would say, like, like, get up, get up off the couch, get out there and, you know, and, like live and have fun and, you know, just enjoy the time that you have. For the Phillips, this past year has been about fighting for gun education. If we don't do something in this country about the gun issue, we're doomed to see the same thing that happened in Aurora and the same thing that happened in Newtown happen again and again and again and again. They've been gun owners for decades and still are believers in their Second Amendment right. After Jessica died, they began working for the Brady campaign to prevent gun violence. A bullet from an AR-15 went flying through the seat that should have protected her and hit her in her head. And they are going to send a bus that's going to arrive in uh, Aurora. We're not trying to control guns. We're trying to promote gun safety. It gives us something uh, that she didn't die in vain. What do you want to see happen? I don't want to see another mother have to walk in my shoes. Their biggest push is for universal background checks. It's difficult to think of any day without Jesse in it. And now we've had a year without Jesse in it. Just six weeks before she was killed, Jessica narrowly escaped a shooting at a mall in Canada. She blogged about it, writing, I was reminded that we don't know when or where our time on earth will end, when or where we will breathe our last breath. Every moment we have to live our life is a blessing. Is there one message that you want to send? Don't think that this can't happen to you.